Good morning. I have a little friend to help me read today. This is Samantha. She's my puppy. Yeah, she's a good little girl. So today's story is The Giant Jumperee. And it is by um, Julia Donaldson and Helen Oxenberry. Here we go. Rabbit was hopping home one day when he heard a loud voice coming from inside his burrow. I'm the giant jumperee, and I'm scary as can be. Help, help, cried Rabbit. What's the matter, Rabbit? asked Cat. There's a giant jumperee in my burrow. What do you think about that? Don't worry, said Cat. I'll slink inside and pounce on him. So Cat slunk up to the burrow, but just as she was about to slink inside, she heard a loud voice. I'm the giant jumpery, and I'll squash you like a flea. That sounds scary. Let's see. Help, help, meowed Cat. What's the matter, Cat, asked Bear. There's a giant jumpery in Rabbit's burrow, said Cat. Don't worry, said Bear. I'll put my big furry paw inside and knock him down. So Bear swaggered up to the burrow, but just as he put his big furry paw inside, he heard a loud voice. I'm the giant jumpery and I'll sting you like a bee. Help, help, bellowed Bear. What's the matter, Bear? asked Elephant. There's a giant jumpery in Rabbit's burrow, said Bear. Don't worry, said Elephant. I'll wrap my trunk around him and toss him away. wonder what the giant jumpery is. So Elephant stomped up to the burrow, but just as he put his long gray trunk inside, he heard a loud voice. I'm the giant jumpery and I'm taller than a tree. Help, help, trumpeted Elephant. Elephant, what's the matter, Elephant, asked Mama Frog. There's a giant jumpery in Rabbit's burrow, said Elephant. Don't worry, said Mama Frog. I'll tell him to come out. That seems kind of silly, that the big elephant is too scared, but the little frog? Hmm, let's see. No, no, don't do that, said all the other animals. He's as scary as can be, said Rabbit. He can squash you like a flea, said Cat. He can sting you like a bee, said Bear. And he's taller than a tree, said Elephant. But Mama Frog took no notice of them. She jumped up to the burrow. I'm the giant jumpery, and you're terrified of me, came the loud voice. The other animals backed away, but Mama Frog wasn't scared. Come on out, giant jumpery, she said. You're the one we want to see, so I'm counting up to three. One... Two, three, and out jumped Baby Frog. Hello, Mama. I'm the giant jumpery. Looks like he's having a good time. And you're coming home for tea, said Mama Frog. Look at everybody laughing. He played a joke on them. There they go. Everybody's going to go for some tea. The end. I hope you enjoyed our story today. Looks like Samantha fell asleep. Have a good day. Bye.